Good morning, everyone. I'm, I'm Stephen Ward. I'm the Burgess Chair of uh, Journalism Ethics here at the School of Journalism and Mass Communication and also the uh, director for the center, the new Center for Journalism Ethics. It's a real pleasure to invite all of you in here today, uh, such a great group. Uh, and I know you've taken your time, you've, you've taken some of your money uh, uh, to come and participate in a dialogue on the future of journalism and good journalism, which is what I mean by ethical journalism. And so I'm so pleased that uh, you would uh, favor us with your presence today and your participation. First of all, uh, I just want to announce something much more important than that. And that is that the Vica Vancouver Canucks beat the Chicago Blackhawks last night 5-3. to three. <laughs> Phil is a little upset by that uh, from Chicago and all. Uh, but uh, let's, let's get beyond that. Uh, first of all, I also want to welcome people who are watching live via their laptops. And so hello out there, wherever you may be, and uh, hopefully you will also participate in the blogs and so on, but a little more on that later. Uh, the aim of our center, if, if I uh, can just say a few words about it, is to advance standards of democratic journalism through research, through teaching, through professional work and application, and public outreach. And we're going to do that in four different ways, through theory and research, through professional work, through teaching and working with our students, and also through public, out public outreach, which includes conferences like this. And I think uh, this is the first annual conference we'll be holding. So uh, we have in your folders, you will see uh, a little index card, and we want some feedback from you at the end. Uh, I think there's something out there, a little dish you can put it in on the way out. And not only uh, what you thought about this conference, uh, but also if you have any ideas about uh, what the next conference should be about uh, in terms of topics, uh, that would be terrific. Now, as I said, we're here to, to discuss the, the future of journalism, and I hope that we're also here to discuss if there are new pathways and new models for journalism in this very difficult transitional period. Uh, we also think, I also think that even though it is difficult times if for many areas of journalism today, that we have, both as professionals and as academics, a duty to be at the leading edge of this discussion and to have these types of public events. I would also say that the, the, the conference that we've arranged, uh, we are so happy the way it's come about. Originally, this was going to be a very small uh, event. Uh, Jim Boffin, the director, and I first said, well, maybe we'll get a few people to come out, we'll have a speaker, and so on. But when we announced that we we're going to do the future of journalism, it just grew like topsy. Uh, and uh, more and more people were interested in it until we have it today. And we think we've got a great starting point for future conferences. Now, I want to say some things in terms of uh, the multimedia event. Um, I'll, uh, I'll get to that a little bit later, but first of all, I want to plug uh, our uh, journalism ethics website, which is uh, journalismethics.info, and I hope you will go there and even write for us in the future. I'll talk about it in a second when we get to the blogging part of things. In terms of participants, look around the room and see who's here. Uh, see your neighbors. Uh, they'll be leading journalists from small and large newspapers. There'll be ethicists, leading uh, media ethicists here are in the room. Uh, there'll be uh, heads of institutes and other centers of journalism and ethics. And there'll be many universities here represented from Georgetown, Loyola, Marquette, uh, and other campuses of UW. And also we have people from uh, our university departments such as commerce, business, political science, history, life sciences, and so on. So I'm expecting a robust and really fascinating discussion, and we're going to try to stress discussion during the sessions and let you uh, participate. My thank yous, of course, to UW and the dean, uh, to Jim Boffman, school faculty, and students who are helping us out. Uh, I want to thank the moderators and panelists, and I especially want to thank uh, Katie Culver uh, for helping us, who is in the School of Journalism, who is indispensable in rounding up students for us uh, to blog and set up the multimedia uh, part of this conference. But finally, I also want to thank the Wisconsin Broadcast Association Foundation. John Lobbs is here. Where are you, John? Raise your hand. There's John. Uh, he spoke at the reception last night very nicely about uh, journalism ethics. And thank you, John, and your association for caring enough and believing in journalism and its future for uh, sponsoring this uh, event. Thank you very much. <laughs>